Hi everyone, this is Sunny Kumar from IIT BHU and welcome to my channel Code with Sunny. And today I am going to discuss the problem short encoding of words. Index number is 820 and the problem is of medium type. Okay, basically, I don't think the problem should be of medium type. The problem is uh, very easy, it requires basic erasing some erasing some words from a set and but uh, we need to identify which word we which words must be erased from this set so let's uh, discuss the problem first okay so a valid encoding of an array of words is any reference string s and an array of indices such that the index the length is going to coincide and the reference string must end with a hash for each index indices of i the substring s is starting from indices of i and up to not including the next uh, hash character is equal to words of i okay given an array of words return the length of shortest reference string possible of any valid encoding of the words okay so if you guys haven't understand the problem yet i will explain the problem in the very simplest manner okay so let's come up to the example one you can see here i have a string of words time me and bell and our output is 10 which is actually the minimum the length of the shortest reference string but first we need to calculate the reference string so what will be our the reference string you can see the reference string is time plus bell uh, separated by hash and again hash now you can see here you can see the suffix in the string in the string of words that is you can see time uh, here you can see the suffix of length to me is exactly coinciding with one of the words me already present in the string of words so we need to eliminate this me because it is making an extra what it, it is making an extra length if we coincide to make a shortest reference string but we can make an uh, more shortest reference string using only the word time uh, from the suffix of it so we need to eliminate this so how we can eliminate this first of all we can store all the string of words in a let's say set to uh, eliminate the distinct the eliminate the distinct words then i'm going to erase all the suffixes from every word so that we can we have the minimum word to be uh, included in our shortest reference strings okay so if some word is coinciding with uh, uh, any of the suffix of the already present word they this will be automatically eliminated once we erase all the suffixes of the given word okay so let's move on to the code because i think the question is very the simplest once we understand it so let's look out for the implementation how we are going to implement this so first i'm going to take an unordered set of strings that is going to store all the strings uh, from this vector of string of words note that why i'm going to use a set because to eliminate the distinct words uh, to eliminate the words that uh, that occurred more than one time okay now i'm going to iterate in the set and erase all the suffixes of the string uh, that will have the that will contribute to the length of shortest reference of words okay shortest length of reference string okay why we need to eliminate the suffixes of the string because some word if occur if have, if some word have already occurred in the vector of string of words and it has the suffix already present in the some uh, word in the vector of strings then we need to eliminate that like here you can see the word me is already present in the uh, one of the word time as a suffix so we need to eliminate that me okay so what i have done is i have iterated in the set and also i have, I, I have iterated in the the particular word and erase the all the occurrences of this substring uh, from the unordered set and finally if i have done with all the words and all the suffixes i have the unordered set as the minimum number of words that needs to be included in our length of shortest reference string so what should be the length of the shortest reference string the length of the shortest reference string would be simply what uh, word word size plus followed by hash so that's why i'm going to increment my answer as the word size plus one one is due to the hash and finally i'm going to return the answer as rest variable so let me run this code and check out yes it is done so basically the problem i don't think must be of medium type it is of an easy version once you understand the problem how we cal calculate or how we compute the length of the shortest reference string of valid encoding of words so if you have any doubts still do not forget to mention in the comment section of the video and i will ask the wish to like this video share this video 
and do subscribe to my youtube channel for latest updates thank you for watching this video